Hi guys, welcome back to another video. It has been a minute and a half. It's been a while. I know. That is why I decided to sit down today and to have a little chat with you guys. Have a little one-on-one -on -one and to explain where I've been for over a year. Why I haven't posted any videos on my channel. What's, what's really going on? So enough of the chit chat. Let's just get into it. And so I'm trying out some new lighting with my YouTube. So I hope it doesn't vary too much or change too much. But let me cut the chit chat and get into the meat of the matter, into the meat of the video. So I checked on my YouTube and my last video was posted on June 14th, 2021. Today, as I'm filming this, it is July 21, 2022. So I haven't posted anything on my YouTube in this time, this entire time. Why, you may ask. At the time, when I decided to take a break, it wasn't supposed to be this long. When I decided to take a break from YouTube, it was to just focus on myself. I felt like I was putting a lot of time into making content and I was really trying to be as consistent as possible and produce the best content possible but i didn't feel like people were really watching my content and sharing my content and i was i was wondering to myself you know why am i really doing this if i'm not really getting you know the feedback i don't feel like people are enjoying my content or really liking it so i decided to just take a step back from youtube just to to focus on myself take a step back from everything not just youtube I took a break from even my writing and all of that just to focus on myself thinking maybe a two months maybe a three months and then i'll be back to youtube in all honesty i've tried to sit down and film this exact video that i'm doing right now before at least two times before and i just couldn't do it it didn't feel right it didn't feel natural it felt like i was forcing myself to do something before the actual time and when i started this youtube journey i said to myself that uh, that i would always try to be as real as possible with whatever i'm doing with whatever type of content that i'm producing and and putting out there and it didn't feel natural for me to come back to youtube at that time i filmed the videos edited them i sat there and i watched them apart from it not feeling natural for me i didn't like how the videos looked and that's because i didn't liked how i looked at the time i put on a lot of weight guys i was weighing almost 87 kgs in february of this year before i started my weight loss and gym journey and for the first time in my life, I didn't feel handsome or attractive. I didn't like seeing myself on camera. And if some of you guys follow me on social media, you may have realized that I didn't post on social media for many months from my birthday last year in September. Up until this year, I didn't post any pictures. I wasn't posting any stories or anything because I didn't want anyone to see me in that light. And if I didn't like looking at myself or seeing myself, I I couldn't have found the courage to actually post that content online because I actually do watch about my YouTube videos when they are online. And if I don't feel confident enough to post it and be able to watch it back, then I wouldn't feel proud of what I'm putting out. So it was very difficult for me to, to find the courage to come back to YouTube. As you know, well, or as you may know, Weight loss is it's a slippery slope and it's a very sensitive topic. Self-love is a very sensitive topic. So even when it is that people around you say that, oh, you're beautiful, nothing wrong with you, you are right in, in patois, it's still difficult for you to find that self-love and self-acceptance. And that is a journey that I'm on, that I started in February of this year. And I'm telling you, or I can tell you now that I've trained so much, not just physically as relates to my weight, but you can see how much I'm smiling and maybe how much I'm glistening and glowing now. A few months ago, that was not the case because I, I wasn't loving myself anymore. I didn't like how I looked. I didn't feel like I was good enough and I was really coming down on myself. 
but I'm on a journey as we all are in this life of self-love, self-love, self love, self self acceptance. Sorry, Maritanos. I'm on a journey of self love and self acceptance and just trying to be the best the best version of myself that I can be and to just give myself grace in all of that. So I made a vow to myself that I would eventually come back to YouTube. It's it wasn't a forever break. I just had to take the time out for myself mentally to just get myself in the frame of mind where I felt like I could produce content again, content that I'm proud of, that I actually love, content that I actually like and not just force myself to do something because everybody's asking me where are the videos, where are the videos and honestly some of you may be asking the question why didn't you just say something on your Instagram, why didn't you just say something on your YouTube, I just didn't know how to say it i didn't know how to structure the words to explain everything that i'm explaining right now and that's why i didn't say anything at all which may not have been the right decision but i'm human and i'm flawed like everyone else and life is about figuring things out you know you have to make mistakes and you have to learn from them and this that and the third so this video is not very long i just wanted to give you guys an update what's going on in in my life why i didn't post anything all this time and what's to come so i'm back on youtube i will try to be as consistent as possible i have some videos that i filmed that i'm going to be putting out very soon after i edit this video and post it on youtube then i will work on those other two videos and continue putting out content I want to thank everyone who reached out to me and people who still messaged me and told me that they were binging my videos. And to my new subscribers, welcome to the channel, welcome to the Romilion, to the King Enthusiast family. I'm really appreciative of all of you. In all the time that I left YouTube, I only lost one subscriber. So I'm really thankful because you guys have remained faithful to the platform. Though some of you may have thought that I left, <laughs> but I'm here, we're back and we're going to be bigger and better and I'm bringing you guys on this life journey with me, this med school journey, this China journey, fashion journey, all of that. Oh, update, I will be starting my fourth year of medical school next month at the end of August into the first week of September there about. So your boy is officially a fourth year medical student, well, to be soon enough and I couldn't be happier. More more videos about the whole med school journey and so on coming soon. That's not really what this video is about. It's just an update video. So thank you guys so much for all your support. I really do appreciate you. And until next time, Sai